Today we're going to take a look at how to get a Chevy Silverado or GMC Sierra started if the key fob dies. This is only going to apply to the trucks that have a push button start ignition. I've taken the battery out of this key fob to demonstrate. As you can see, none of the buttons are working. If I try to start the vehicle as I normally would, I'm going to get a message here saying no remote detected. So what we need to do is place our key fob into what your owner's manual refers to as the transmitter pocket. In a vehicle with bucket seats as this one has, It'll be in there like that, right in between the cup holders. If you have a bench seat and a third seat right here, the transmitter pocket will be in the lower compartment, and you can find an exact picture of that um, in your owner's manual if you're unfamiliar. But once the key fob is in the transmitter pocket, we can then start the vehicle as normal. 